Listen, man. You gotta ask yourself. Not why did Muwap have them shoes. Why did Gucci make them shoes? For those of you who don't know what shoes I'm talking about, I'm about these. So yeah, get into it, man. The O Block indictment shit, right? Cause I ain't, I ain't, I want to do this shit till I knew I could do it absolutely right as possible. That shit, uh, they didn't kill up. That's all I'm gonna say on that. They did not. Watch that video. Listen, listen to the cameraman's words and why he's so trying to know what the situation with Doug is. Get out of it. Usually, when people do a hit and it's like really organized, there's gonna be somebody there to either check dude or whatever and make sure that dude's dead. You see what I'm saying? So the way that the cameraman was acting was sort of like the person who's supposed to verify this shit. All right. My thing is, Gucci released them shoes. Why? You see what I'm saying? Why them particular shoes at that particular time? You could, you could buy them shits right now. Them was not custom. Them was some shit, maybe that's a limited run or some shit. They $930, they not one of a kind, none of that. Buy them shits right now. So, there been a big conspiracy, I heard King Rob talk about it, where there's a, a dude who's like, he don't look like a regular cop. He don't look like he's supposed to be there. He don't, he don't got a name tag on his shit. He don't got, there is nothing that looks like, if I remember right, he just has like a regular, like, it don't even look like a CPD badge. Um, so it's just like, it's mad weird that this motherfucker is there. It's like, why? You see what I'm saying? Like, why is this, you, know, you see what I'm saying? It's weird. So long story short, man, it's like, um, you got to think like, what's good with this motherfucker? You know what I'm saying? What's what's the whole scope of this shit? Who knew that this was gonna happen? What's that sound like a fucking the dude they interviewed for the news was like it was like it was like artillery, it was like <laughs> like motherfuckers was dumping, like it was fully automatic shit. And and the way the cameras was all the cameras saw nothing. That that tells me, you know what I'm saying, like that shit was was a definitely an inside job. It was an inside job, and I'm saying that in terms of someone who, who had some big in that area had the control of them cameras or that footage or something. And if he was around that Gucci store, that would raise a lot of questions to me. I believe he was at the Chanel or the Louis store in particular, but if he was around that Gucci store or Dolce & Gabbana store, he was at... He was not at the Gucci store, I know that. But if that Gucci store is in view of them cameras, that's real strange to me. Alright. So uh like I said, man, like, comment, share, subscribe. I'm not gonna go too much more into this till I have some more details on what's going on with actual members of O Block and whatnot. Um wouldn't be surprised if I see some shit about Dirk. But you know, I'm gonna leave that door open for now. Oh, one more thing, one more thing, right? Yeah. One more thing, right? Don't be going to ask me if you don't mind about nothing. I, I, you know, I meant to speak on this a minute ago, man. Hassan Campbell, I agree with him on, like, multiple points. But that's one thing, man, where it's like, bro, that woman done lost so much already, man. Just leave that shit alone, homie. Like, you should just be glad you got some type of recognition or something at that point, man. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Like, I did, like... You see what I'm saying? Just, just leave that woman alone. Period. Just leave, leave that bitch, that mama alone. Just do that, please. Cause we don't, we don't need all this disrespect, women bullshit going on, man. We really don't. All right, be easy, man.